So friends, again welcome to my video on Finical system. I have been continuing, I have been generating various videos so that you can learn something useful, screenshots because live server is not available. So as soon as it is available, I will try and show you from there also. So this is a very important command. Those of you are working as teller, as cash officers or as service officers in certain banks they are called as when they work in the cash receipt and payment system on the front desk so this is very important inquiry report hfti so h i told you is prefixed in all the commands of finical since it is connected with html now, fti full form is financial transaction inquiry this menu can be used to inquire on transactions using various selection criteria user to invoke menu option hfti by entering the same in menu option field and click on go system will display the hfti criteria screen now this is has got lot of customization in this suppose you want to generate for particular particular cash generations cash deposit up to 50,000 25,000 you can do that cash entries or any current account only savings account only anything it can be customized user id wise this can be generated so this is a very useful command or tool at the hands of the those officers who are sitting in the front desk and it is very important to do day end before doing day end you have to keep on checking how many financial transactions transactions are to be entered or to be verified by the officer so this is again a very very important command that i am discussing it with you another is i will be showing it with you hafi so this is for financial transactions hafi that is for audit file inquiry all the non financial transactions suppose a customer has given a request for checkbook or has given a request for making a check for stop payment they are to be entered in the system immediately so that has to be seen how many of those are pending for verification suppose a customer has given a letter for stopping a payment of a particular check and that has not been verified and that check is already pending in the clearing inward clearing it may get cleared if the, that entry is not verified by the verifying officer. So these are very important HFTI and HAFI audit file inquiry. These two reports you have to keep on generating if you want to do day and as quickly as possible because certain banks there is a timeline which every branch has to adhere to for making doing a day and at the end of the day so this screen appears on your computer hfti financial transaction inquiry it has various customizations suppose soul id so of course it will be the same branch wherever it is being done but one can see view other branches entries also but there is no need for that right account soul id so id set id the way the branch is working account id suppose you want to generate a report for any particular account that can be chosen here or you can leave it blank please remember this all those fields marked with the star asterisk are mandatory rest are if required or not so you can see the whole field you can see here only soul id is mandatory and generally it is the, the same branch wherever this inquiry is being made right so i'll just show you very what you all customization you can do to view for your convenience so account id if you want to see for account id wise right then transaction id suppose you want to view any transaction just enter the transaction id here you will get the report here right transaction type if it is cash transfer or clearing right if you want to see any all the credit entries or you want to see only debit entries or you want to see both the entries so you can see here these radio buttons are there credit 
debit and all and generally we choose all but you can choose if you want to see only credit entries you want to debit entries so this is as for your requirement and needs suppose you want to see any checkbook inquiry check inquiry you can enter here student number here this is first part is for alpha second part is for numericals instrument type if it is a check if it is a dividend warrant so you can go on the searcher here click on this you can choose any generally it will be chq or if it is not required you leave it blank now start date and end date so you can view suppose account id you want to see for the whole month you can choose start date as per the month as per an end date as per today's date and as per your requirement if it is not there you just want to see for today's generally what happens tell us do it on daily basis so generally both the dates remain the same but if you require it you can change the range of the dates as well right okay ccy code inr ccy currency code will be there account status you can select here if you want to generate the report for let's say inoperative accounts right or uh, which have not been operated right dormant accounts you can see here right deposit accounts details here user transaction code you can be entered here right so account label generally you leave it blank transaction status you can select here posted verified or unverified whatever just or you can just leave it blank here right so you get this here then uh, that is all okay so this is all the fields are as per requirement or if you just type sole id here don't enter anything this report for the branch will be generated in whatever financial transaction inquiry have been done in the branches be it debit be it credit whatever finance financial transactions are in state i will show you the status also posted not verified or entered state right so you have to keep on doing it if any voucher is pending at yours you give it to your verifying officer sir please verify this entry is pending because as i told you in earlier video if the entry is in a posted status customer can withdraw even if it is not verified so as an prudent employee as a prudent officer ensure that whatever is entries you have made in the system are verified by the officer so that chances of error are minimized and if customer withdraws any excess money deposited in his account by mistake by you can be rectified before he withdraws it generally it becomes i've seen cases i've seen many cases being a banker where customer refuse to deposit back illegal money that he got in got in his account or he just sought time or just try to blackmail so you just have to be very alert right so this is how it is generated here so friends you get this report here right you can see here transaction date you can choose for value dating also if any entry is value dated right so from which date it is value dated generally it is the same day you can see here generally it is the same date right transaction id you can get suppose in a voucher you forgot to write down transaction id number as a maker as a first officer you can generate this or inquire this report and from the amount you can verify whichever the transaction number is and the account number you can choose it from here right so these are transaction ids system generated if it is verified by the system the system generated transaction id will appear here cash you can see here this these top are four cash entries cash receipt cash credited deposited by the customer so these all are in posted two are in posted status two are in verified status so you can see here status also so this is in posted is posted state this has to be got verified next also next also all these are to be got verified immediately one can view from here or even verifying officer can also view from here what all entries are pending for his verification so that day and 
takes place smoothly and quickly and as well you also can get time to do other works in the branches or you can finish off your work immediately right so transaction type you can see here cash transfer transfer so all the financial transactions done in the branch on that day or up to that time in a day you can generate it at 12 pm 1 pm or 11 am you can generate at any time right amount this shows amount here and if you want to view the details right to so account further details what time it was made who was the user who was the checker who was the maker can be shown here so this is a detail icon you can search if you want to do it and this report can be inquired now this was hfti if you want to generate the report the menu option is hftr financial transaction report this is this is just for viewing so i have seen smart bankers viewing this report getting it verified telling the verifying officer these vouchers are pending for verification please verify as soon as possible so that you are also safe bank is also safe and work also finishes in time so that you get time to do other work because time management is very important so this menu option is very important for time management so in this screen you can see also if you want to see all the transactions which are in entered state so they are added to be posted by another officer or verified by the another officer only then customer can withdraw money if he has deposited the cash or his balance gets updated in the general ledger of the branch or of the bank of the main server so you can see you can choose from i told you earlier also entered state status posted status verified status so you can further customize further and you get the report on your screen you can inquire see what all transactions are to be posted if it is in entered state or posted to be verified if in posted status right so your work time management is done smoothly so you get this report here transaction date same here value date generally the dates are the same the value dating is an, uh, it's a very uh, one of the actions which has to be verified and it has to be done because it has uh, various financial ramifications for the branch transaction id number system generated here so transfer entries you can see here ccy all inr indian rupees transfer entries right these all are in entered states here tds tds credit account credit for so and so right so this is tds credit so tds parking after deduction debit the tds has been deducted here so these all are in entered state you can see here all these are being shown in entered state only so because we have cho customizedly chosen all the entries which are in entered status should be shown to us right this is account number here so just to give you an idea how the report is viewed and generated also well, friends here you can see this can be generated by user id suppose there are two tellers working right or two officers so this can be generated by officer id wise so all the ids of alok all the transactions all the entries in entered status here this is entered status so alok can verify from here ki bhai meri kitni entries hain jo entered status mein hai जो पोस्ट या वेरिफिकेशन के लिए पेंडिंग है सो ही कैन व्यू और जनरेट द रिपोर्ट फ्रॉम हेयर आल्सो। सो फ्रेंड्स दिस स्क्रीनशॉट शोज के इफ यू वांट टू सी एनी डिटेल्स व्यू डिटेल्स हेयर सो वट एवर द हेयर इट इज यू कैन क्लिक ऑन हेयर डिटेल हेयर यू कैन सी वॉट टाइम द कैश वॉज डिपॉजिटेड इन दी अकाउंट राइट सो ऑल दीज आर हेयर अकाउंट आई डी जनरेटेड कैन बी हेयर सो आई होप यू इंजॉय दिस इज अगेन आई एम रीच रेटिंग this is very very important and very very useful command for doing your work as a smart banker managing your time properly and being efficient so that you don't suffer any losses either financially or through time management so that you can focus on other areas where you have to deliver results any query please ping me i'll be very glad to answer you i hope you are enjoying this again this is HFTI and HAFI audit file inquiry HFAI is for 
non financial transactions even otherwise any entry is pending either in financial transactions or in non financial transactions the day end will not take place unless un until those entries are verified so it's better to get a lot of load of work at the day end before doing a proper day end in the system you keep on while you're working in the branches be alert be sharp keep on getting it done work done this is to be verified so you have to be on your toes so this was a very important video i think any queries please again i would request to ping me i would be glad to answer any suggestions any query you can do it thank you